Phone Arena presents a video review of the Nokia 6700 Swite, which is a very compact and appealing smartphone. The 6700 uh, Swite has a really nice build quality. The entire back cover is made of aluminium and the same goes for a good part of the front. In addition, the swiping mechanism is very stable, so as a whole the, the phone feels really solid while in the hand. The display measures 2.2 inches and has a resolution of 240 by 320 pixels, which is good enough for this screen size. However, once you look at the display from a certain angle, you'll notice that the quality of its uh, image begins to decrease. The keys below the display are very well made, they have a very decent click, so it's easy to tell once you have pressed a certain key. The same goes for the numeric keypad. Although they are relatively small, typing away SMS messages with this uh, keypad is very easy and very enjoyable. There is no volume rocker on the sides of the 6700 Swite, there is only this camera shutter. On the top side we find a 2.5mm headset jack, a Nokia port for charging and the star standard micro USB port, which can also be used to charge the phone. On the back side there is the 5 megapixel camera with autofocus and the dual LED flash. Here is the interface of the Nokia 6700 Swite. As we said, it uses the Symbian S60 3rd edition operating system, which has a very rich catalogue of additional applications that you can install on your device. Of course, you have access to Ovi Store, which is Nokia's official app store. Um, and while there are quite a few apps there, keep in mind that uh, what you'll find in there is far from everything that's been created for this operating system. Anyway, this is the home screen. At the top you have this contacts bar. Um, here you can store your favorite contacts. And this lets you quickly dial a contact, send them a text message or view their RSS feed if they have one. Below you have quick access to the calendar and you can also see if there is an event scheduled for this particular day. You have quick access to the, to the email. And down below you have six positions for apps that you use the most. Here is the main menu. It can be visualized in a number of different ways, but uh, still we prefer this standard grid-like layout because um, it provides the easiest way to use it. From here we can jump to the calendar. Of course, it is identical to the one found on other cell phones using this operating system. It's nice that um, in the lower part of the screen you can see if there, if there are any events scheduled for a particular date. So here is how you create an event. You can uh, select the time frame and then you just enter a title, date and time, you can add a reminder, alarm and so on. Here is the gallery app. You see that Nokia has uh, created a very nice animated uh, interface, which can also be viewed in landscape mode. Here is how you switch between photos. And of course, uh, viewing your photos with uh, such animated uh, transitions is very very uh, pleasant. Here is the browser of the Nokia 6700 Swite. It has this overview option which is very he helpful when it comes to navigating in uh, more complex pages. With a single click you zoom to such a level that you can easily read the text. As you can see scrolling is uh, pretty smooth so using this browser is very comfortable. Um, it is as comfortable as it can be on a non-touch device. In addition, the browser supports flash white, which allows you to view YouTube videos. You just select your video from the mobile YouTube site 
and it plays automatically in this player. With a single click you jump to full screen mode. Finally we believe that the Nokia 6700 Swite is one very good phone. It is very appealing and um, in case that you don't like the stylish looks of our unit keep in mind that the, this phone is also offered in many other color solutions. It has some really characteristic looks thanks to these um, circular keys here on the front. It's very well made, have a decent camera. Well, uh, its main disadvantages are that uh, it lacks Wi-Fi and uh, that it has a 2.5mm jack instead of a 3.5mm one. But still, you have the Symbian S63 3rd edition operating system which allows you to install a lot of uh, additional applications in order to extend the functionality of this device. So we believe it's a very good choice in case you need a compact and good looking smartphone. For more information on the Nokia 6700 Swite and many many other phones you can visit us at phonearena.com